Hey FitFab, we are live on the set of Mary's Kitchen. We're at the start of week three of our social distancing because of the pandemic that's going around. I'm sure some of you guys have more time on your hands now than before. And this is the perfect time to not only stay safe, but to also stay healthy by boosting your immune system. Today, I will share with you my Mexican stuffed sweet potato recipe as part of our seven day immune boosting recipe book. Let's get started. Okay, so I'm just going to preheat my pan, my frying pan, and I'm just going to lightly drizzle it with olive oil. And let's heat that up. And over here I have some chopped onion. I have about three quarters of a cup of black beans, about three quarters of a cup of quinoa, and half a cup of corn. And for time's sake, I've already roasted my sweet potato in the oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for about 40 minutes. So while this pan is getting hot, oh, I think mine's hot already, I'll just add my onion. You want this nice and soft. And then I'll add in some black beans. And also some cooked quinoa. And you want this cooked for about, let's say, three or four minutes. Now, our Mexican stuffed sweet potato, it's, um, the main ingredient is the sweet potato and it's an immune boosting food because it's filled with vitamins A, which helps support your immune system, vitamin C, which helps your cells um, from damage caused by free radicals, and it's also filled with um, vitamins K and B vitamins as well. So it's really good for you. Next, I will be adding about a tablespoon of chili powder. And also about a teaspoon of cumin. And then just some salt and pepper for taste. if you want to add some chili pepper you could my son doesn't like spice so I'm just going to omit the chili pepper Jerome can you smell this yes oh, man, it smells so good right now it does <laughs> I really like corn, so I will be adding about half a cup of corn. And let this cook for about another minute. If you want to add some cheese to this, you could. I think just for me, for my calories, I'm going to omit the cheese. It's totally optional. Okay, I think this is done. I'll just turn this off. Okay, so here is my roasted sweet potato that I've cooked ahead of time. And this will serve two. You just want to cut it in half like that. And then you just want to lightly fluff the inside of your sweet potato. 
just so it's nice and soft. Like that. Doesn't have to be fancy, just mashed up a little bit. And then we will take our filling and we will put it on top. Like that. And also just top it off with some sour cream. Oh, that fell. There we go. And then green onions. And there you have it. What do you think, Jerome? Oh, man, it looks so delicious right there. <laughs> oh, I know, I can't wait. By jam packing, each meal with immune boosting foods is a great way to reduce your risk for getting sick and decrease the number of sick days. Preparing everything once or twice a week will save you time and ensure that a nutritious and delicious meal is ready when you're hungry. If you like this video of my immune boosting Mexican stuffed sweet potato, please let me know. Share it, take me in a photo, and I'll see you on the blue. Ah! <laughs> I was reading it too fast. <laughs>